everyone. So this week, the focus in our maths learning is doubling. So doubling is where we have an amount and then we have the same amount again to find double. Okay, so I'm going to talk through your activities for this week to do with doubling. So have a little look. Activity one is all to do with magical butterflies. Now, a butterfly here has got no spots. What you have to do is choose a number between one and five and draw or paint spots on one side of your magic butterfly. Now, if you have got some paint at home, it would be brilliant to make a magic butterfly using those. So I'm going to choose the number three. I'm going to do three red spots on one of my butterfly's wings. Are you ready? One, two, three. Now, if you've painted them and you fold your piece of paper in half and you say, oh me, oh my, let's pull this butterfly. When you open it back up again, it should have three spots on the other wing. So what we've done is we have doubled the number of spots on one side to the other. So in this one, we started with one, two, three. And I wanted to find double three. When I doubled my magic butterfly, I've now got all together one, two, three, four, five, six. Have a little look underneath. So double three equals six all together. So that is how we double. Now have a little go at that one. You can either make your own butterflies at home or there are some on the worksheet for you to cut out and use to make your own butterflies. If you don't have any paint, don't worry. You can draw your spots on one side, but make sure you draw the same on the other side to double. Because we're doubling, we should end up with more at the end. You can see here, that six is more than three. So we've doubled. Okay. Moving on to activity two. It's still to do with doubling, but this time we're going to double our Numicon pieces. So have a look at the question here, which I've stolen from your worksheet for this week. So the Numicon piece, first of all, here we've got is two. One, two. I want to find what double two is. So if you look here, we've got another two because doubling means the same number again. It's the same as two, add another two. So we're using our add sign again here today. You should have practiced last week. So two, add two. Can you remember what this sign is? Yeah, it's the equal sign again, which tells us that this is where we need to put our answer. So I'm going to drop them down underneath, which you can do as well if you want to have a go at home. So we've got two. We're going to add another two, to show we've doubled the number. How many all together? So we're going to count together. One, two, three, four. So our answer was four, and we're going to write that in the box. Are you ready? Down and across and down some more. That's the way we make a four. So double two equals four. And it's a different way of showing you how to double. Moving on to activity number three. Now you can see here it's slightly different again. We haven't got the pictures or the Numicon to help us. You can see straight away we've got two of the same number because we know doubling means the same number again. Now, you might want to work this out on a number line, you're counting on another three, or you can use a butterfly again from activity one. You could use your Numicon again from activity two, or you could draw some pictures to help you. So I'm going to draw some pictures to help. I'm going to do three spots. One, two, three. And to double it, I need another three. Ready? One, two, three. My there has to be more. So my answer is how many all together? So let's have a look. You 
you going to count them with me? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six. So our answer after our equal sign is six. If you're unsure how to write number six, you can have a look back on our number rhymes to help you on the website. Okay? Activity number three is the number sentences to work out the doubles. Moving on to activity number four, we've got some ladybirds this time. Now, do our ladybirds, what we need to do is first of all, have a look at how many is already given to us, okay? We're going to count how many spots are on the ladybird on this side. We've got one, two. Can you remember what to do when we're doubling? What do I need to make sure I have on this side? Yeah, I need to have the same amount. So if I've got two here, I need another two here. Okay. Now you've got a box underneath for this question to fill in number sentence to match when you've done your ladybird doubles. So we started with two spots. They were already given to us. And we're going to double or add the same amount. So to do the add sign, we're down and across. We doubled, so we need number two again. Don't forget your equal sign. How many all together? You can cross them. One, two, three, four. So our answer is four. Okay, so you've got to do that with some other ladybirds on your worksheet activity number four. And your final activity, number five, is this one. Okay, now what you have to do, you've got a list of numbers. And I would love to see how many of your double facts you can remember without working them out. Do you know what is double four? From all the numbers that you've practiced earlier in the week, can you remember what double four is? Have a think. Have you got it? Don't worry if not. Double four is. Eat. If you know it, put it in straight away, okay? Because we want to try and get really quick at learning our number facts. If you don't know it and you think, I can't remember this one, then all you have to do is use one of the methods you've practiced this week and work it out. So you might want to draw four spots. Imagine you've got your butterfly there, your ladybird. To double the amount, we need another four, two, three, four. And then count them all together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, or you might use your numicon to work it out, or you could count on another four. Have a go at all the activities for this week. I know Mrs. Harrison and myself can't wait to see all your brilliant work. Keep up the brilliant work. See you all soon. Bye.